The world is full of magic, energies, and so many possibilities. What if I told you, you can have anything you want? Yes, anything. Because with the universe, anything is possible. You are magic. Your thoughts are powerful. Your words are powerful. And what you believe is what you attract into your world. With the power of manifestation, you can create anything you want. Yes, anything you want. My shop, Jalissa's Manifestations, provides the tools to help you attract your desires, your wishes, your dreams. My candles are infused with crystals which hold energies and specific herbs to attract your manifestations. All you need is a wish and to believe. Energies are real and control your moods and what you attract. Sometimes we can feel depleted or in need of a boost of energy and that's what my spiritual baths are for. Cleansing, protecting, attracting love, abundance, and opportunities. The possibilities are endless. All you need is to believe. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dreams. Believe in the magic inside you. Just believe. hello my beautiful souls how are you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are blessed okay it is your girl jalissa and i'm coming to you guys with a pick a card reading per the usual now i put a poll and i put some topics and my family chose this as their next topic new love for my singles okay all right guys so we're gonna see for my singles people out here you know single mingling with no commitment okay we're gonna see what's coming your way in love all right who's coming when it's coming how it's coming what to expect all right baby so we have three piles to select from part one we have the pineapple with the heart sunglasses hello <laughs> part two we have the sun you are my sunshine part three we have this sunflower in a mason jar just hydrating bless drinking that water that h2o <laughs> all right guys so timestamps are down below but i do want you guys to take your time and when i mean down below i mean in the description okay just in case um but i want to i want you guys to take your time choosing your pile get zen get chill go grab a cup of water coffee milk scotch wine whatever your cup of tea is get a snack because we're gonna have a discussion baby i'm gonna get as much details as possible for you guys all right so take your time choosing your pile so that you choose your right pile so choose intuitively do not choose because the sticker is the cutest one here <laughs> okay choose the one that is calling you all right close your eyes open your eyes and see which one is calling you all right, baby, bless. Before we get into this beautiful reading, I'm going to give a quick PSA, which is very important. So stay tuned for that one. And I have to give grace before we eat. You already know. All right, guys. So PSA, PSA, PSA. Please be careful, guys, with these scammers. There's people impersonating me using my picture, name, and logo. All right. They're in my comments telling people, hey, if you want a personal reading, reach out to me on what's up. Here's my number. Okay, guys, I would never like write to you guys and tell you that you need services and here's my info. All right, if I was to offer services, I would let you guys know in the video or in my description. So please do not fall for these scammers. I am in the comments writing back, but I'm not offering services in the comments. So I want you guys to, um, you know, pay attention to the red flags, okay? <laughs> and um, also, I'm not doing any personal readings at this time because I am very busy helping the world, the collective, with my manifestation shop. And it is part of my mission besides this one on YouTube. So I am very devoted and dedicated, and I don't really have much time because I have a lot of people I'm working for. All right, guys, bless. I'm super, super, super thankful for that. If you guys want to check out any of my manifestation products, my shop is down below with a promo. Take advantage. All right, so let's get it. I'm going to give grace now. Bless. All right, I want to give my first thank yous to you. Yes, you, baby, for being here today. 
blessed thank you for giving me your time and interest i love you i also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have liked shared commented subscribed onto my channel thank you so much for riding this beautiful wave with me here on youtube i love you guys so much Bless. I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who followed me on Instagram. Thank you guys so much. The family is just growing. It's so warm. It's so beautiful. And I just can't wait to connect with every single one of you guys. Now, I am one person, so I'm trying to make it happen. But, you know, divine timing, okay? <laughs> That's all I can say. Everything's going to happen at its time. But I do plan to connect with all of you guys. I love you guys so much. And I am very thankful. If you guys want to find me on Instagram, my Instagram is J-U-1-I-Z-Z-A. Bless. My only Instagram, guys. And in my bio, I have another page. But um, I think I'm going to bring that one down to just cause less confusion with people, you know, because all these scammers. Anyway, um, next, I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have purchased any of my extended readings, my after parties. Thank you guys so much for following me over to Gumroad for those extra readings. All right, we do get more details and I'm excited and happy to do those readings for you guys. And I'm also thankful because of you guys. I'm able to be here on YouTube doing what I do best, which is spilling the tea. All right, so I'm super, super thankful, guys. Thank you. I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have donated anything to the channel, whether it's decks, crystals, charmies, um, money, whatever you donate towards my family, me, um, goes right back to the channel. So I am forever thankful and I love you guys so much for being so generous and I hope you guys get the same blessing in return in tenfold. Bless. I also want to say thank you, last but not least, um, well, not really last but not least, but I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have purchased any of my manifestation products, my candles, my mist, my bundles, my baths, my crystals. Baby, we got so much going on in the shop right now that I feel like it's like Pandora's box. It's like literally like Amazon for spiritual healing, okay? <laughs> and manifestation, manifestations. All right, um, so I'm just thankful, guys, for you guys supporting me, especially last week. I posted a video talking about my candles and um you guys really went out there and supported a sister and i just love you guys so much so so much and i am happy to be here doing my magic my work for you guys all right bless and last but not least i want to say thank you spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels for being here with me today to channel this beautiful message for the collective bless all right, let's get it, let's go, let's get it, let's go. Enough with the mushy stuff. <laughs> All right, let's go. Part one, part two, part three. I will find you at your pile. Let's find out who your new boo-boo or your boo's going to be, okay? Bless. <laughs> Hello, my beautiful souls. What's up, part one? Welcome to your reading. Let's go. All right, bless. All right, Spirit, Ancient Ancestors, Universe, Spiritual Guides, Angels, please come through and help me channel this message for the collective. Bless. Spirit, what is Paul 1's angel number? We're going to start the reading with your angel number, and then we're going to get into the T. All right, so Paul 1, we got 6514. Go on to Google, put 6514, angel number meaning, and bam, there goes your message from Spirit. Let me know what it is. I love when you guys put it in the comments. What? It's so, like, um, like it's so amazing, all right? Because it's, like, easy for me to read, you know? I, I don't have to Google all of them, all right? Because it's three meanings, all right? So, you know, it helps a sister out. <laughs> Bless. All right, part one, you guys chose the pineapple with the sunglasses, all right? So, are we cool or what, all right? Chilling, cool vibes. Part one, when it, we're doing a reading on new love, right? This is for my singles. What's coming in, all right? Something definitely refreshing. Something definitely that's gonna like change up your world. Mm -hmm. I'm getting detox vibes. This is gonna help you detox, Paul One. And it's super cool and loving. You're gonna feel cool. You're gonna feel loving vibes. And it's gonna help you to detox is the main message that I'm getting here, Paul One. All right, so you may have to like, there may be things that you need to release um detox from your world and this new person this person that's coming in with this new love is going to help you detox which is beautiful all right baby bless okay mm -hmm. 
I don't know. I'm getting some beach vibes I'm because I'm seeing the beach. Okay, so this person could be a water sign. Maybe you're a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or they have it in their chart. But I'm definitely getting some beach vibes. Yamaye energy. This is like beautiful vibes. All right, so let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for the collective. All right. Bless. Spirit, talk to me. What is Paul 1's affirmation for the day? All right, Paul 1, we're going to pull an affirmation for you. This is what Spirit wants you to remind yourself, okay, every day. Let's go. Let's see. Spirit, what is the affirmation for Paul 1? Oh, we got two. All right, we got I accept myself just as I am. I am one of a kind soul and my differences are my superpowers. All right, baby, bless. You are very different. You're unique. You're in your own lane, all right? You're not riding people's waves. You're creating your own wave. And that's beautiful. That's powerful. That's why you're so different. Uh -huh. And Spirit is saying that you should tell yourself this on a daily basis. I accept myself as I am because I'm special. I'm unique. I create the wave. I don't ride the wave, all right? I am one of a kind soul. And my differences are my superpowers. Bless. So the fact, whatever, whatever it is that makes you different baby pa one is actually your superpower okay very unique souls out here pa one all right my outlook on life remains fresh fresh like that detox okay so spirit wants you to remind yourself daily that your outlook on life remains fresh you have a fresh view on life every day possibilities are endless blessed and then we have, oh, this is so cute. We have a dragon here. Some of you guys may be dragons in the Chinese calendar. I am powerful beyond my wildest dreams. Dragons are very, very powerful. Dragon energy is very, very powerful. Look it up on Google when you have, you know, time. Look up dragon energy. It's so powerful. And you guys have this major power. And so Spirit wants you to remind yourself on a daily basis, I am powerful beyond my wildest dreams. I'm more powerful than I even know. Okay? Because you haven't tapped into all your powers, Pal One. All right? You're very gifted. Bless. Okay, let's get a song out here for you guys, Pal One. And then we're going to go into your reading. All right? Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels. Please come through and help me channel this energy this message for pal one spare what is the vibe for pal one new love new love what's the vibe what's the energy what can they expect what's coming what's going what's happening my new deck is coming and i'm hoping and i'm praying and i'm crossing my fingers that it comes today all right so i'm so excited you'll see in um my board i'll post it on my community board if i do get it today because i'm so stoked and excited all right we have casey and jojo all my life whoa all right i will never find another lover sweeter than you sweeter than you and i will never find another lover more precious than you more precious than you baby pa one casey and jojo all my life i pray for someone like you and I thank God that I, that I finally found you. All right, that is the vibes. Okay, powerful energies. Then in the back of the deck, we have Janae Echo BS. It seems like I give so much and don't get nothing back. I really thought it was love, but you're so fucking whack. Always get caught up in love, but I am done with that. I can't get caught up in lust. So now I'm, um, yeah, flexing on my exes and my model ex. Pretty little skinny little bitty body model X. Some of y'all ain't never had no real bitch and it shows. Okay, so this is what you're gonna detox, okay? You've been dealing with a lot of F boys, F girls, however it goes, uh -huh. um, people that are whack that just kind of like hurt you and you gave them your all and they never gave you anything back, not even half of what you gave. So... This is what we're detoxing, Pa One. All right, the bullshit. All right, BS. And we're receiving all my life. Okay, <laughs> all my life. We're release. We're releasing those those 
bad energies all right this is what this new love is gonna help you do it's gonna help you release what you need to release which is um past events exes you're gonna be flexing on your exes is what spirit is saying in your model x okay <laughs> bless all right let's go spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through and help me channel this message for pow one bless spirit talk to me for my singles my my singles ready to mingles what's going on in new love what's coming next in love love all right spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through and help me channel this message for paul one spirit what is coming towards paul one with new love what's coming towards paul one and new love A lot of temptations are coming your way, Paul One. I must admit, I must tell you that because that's what I'm getting. Temptations, temptations, a lot of temptations. All right, whoever this person is that's coming in, there's going to be a lot of um, people trying to tempt you into other situations. All right, this could be exes. Exes coming back because you're flexing on them. Okay, with your model X. All right, so let's see. Spirit. Talk to me about Paul One singles. What's coming their way in love? New love. What's happening? What's going on? What can they expect? What is coming, baby? Yeah, a lot of people are going to try to take you off your path. Justice. Yep, you're getting your justice. Bless. All right, Libra energy. Libras. Libra gang, what's up? Uh-huh. You may have Libra in your chart. You may be a Libra. Okay, Six of Wands. Talk to me about it. Yes, all right. Ooh, this is positive vibes, but we yes, it is. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> wow. I'm high vibing right now. This is good vibes, all right? The fool. Yeah, this is a new beginning. Bless. Yeah. We already got two major arcanas with that six of wands in between, which is celebrations. Hello. Wow, the universe, another major arcana. This is gonna be a major vibe here. That's all I gotta say. No pun intended. Okay, Um, this is big energy right here. Wow, this is definitely like, wow, this person is destined to come into your world. Whatever's going on here, this is like destined energies, okay? Ace of Cups, new romance, new love, happy vibes, happy love seven of cups you're gonna have i told you i told you i knew it i felt it i see it yeah i love when i get my confirmations <laughs> it's such an ego boost i know i know i know um but yeah exactly what i said there's gonna be temptations okay because you're gonna have options so i definitely see that there is a special somebody that's being sent to you by the universe so far so you know what i'm pulling here and what i channeled already and this special somebody is going to be amazing because you're gonna it's like your life is gonna take a little shift here in the, in a good way all right you're gonna feel very victorious all right spirit new love was coming towards pal one talk to me about it oh my is journey all right it's part of your path all right and that number two yeah you're at the fork of the road when you meet this person for some of you guys it could be during travels all right we have finances constraints and reverse okay so this is like not gonna affect your finances this is not gonna affect you in any sort of way financially which is beautiful bless all right so let's get like a little more vibes on the table and we're gonna go into this this is a beautiful message, Pa One. Bless. All right, Spirit. What's coming towards Pa One and new love? New love. What can they expect? What's coming towards Pa One and new love? All right, we have let your friends help you, okay? So your friends are definitely going to be a support system during this time when you find this new love, okay? Yeah, there is separation here, all right? So I definitely see you single separated um from a past person who is really still hurting over you yeah you're releasing this ex and you're keeping an open mind when it comes to love that's why this new partner this new love is coming into your world all right you're having a hard time releasing this ex this past connection it was deep is what i'm seeing all right it was deep and it's a little difficult to release but this is why the universe is sending you this person here who's part of your path by the way Who's going to help you detox? Who's going to help you um, 
see clearly and help you release this ex all right help you release this past lover who is weighing heavily on you we're gonna talk about it okay all right spirit talk to me about this new person though spirit who is this new person what does Paul one need to know about this new person what 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 can we tell them what's the juice all right we have capricorn so this person could be a capricorn bless all right <laughs> they're sexy oh okay all right so you're definitely gonna be attracted to this person okay just be careful because they're a little bit of a liar all right so you know there has to be a balance somewhere all right they can't be perfect um, so just be careful with that. But you guys are very powerful is what I'm getting. There's a lot of power here. You guys are very intuitive. So you're going to pick up if this person is lying. Okay. We have Virgo. All right. So they could have Virgo in their chart. Be a Virgo. Sexy. Sexy. Can I? They're a smoker. All right. So they could smoke cigarettes, weed, however it goes. Hookah. You know. Depends on what they smoke. But they're smokers. Okay. So they do smoke. Maybe occasionally maybe daily all right leo all right they can have leo oh if it's a leo mm -mm -mm. leos are great lovers mm -hmm. we have flirt all right so definitely um this person is sexy they like to flirt it's like i'm sexy and i know it very confident energy they also like to drink all right so this person likes to have fun all right live a little is what i'm getting here because they're a drinker they're a smoker all right there is something karmic about this situation, all right? So I do see the connection here. You are meant to meet this person. This person is meant to come into your life for a big reason, and it's coming out here. So there is something karmic. Doesn't mean that they're a karmic, okay? Dancer, this person likes to go out and dance. Okay, I'm getting a vibe. And we have Aquarius. So they could also be an Aquarius or have this in their chart. Bless. All right, let's get into this. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pal One. Bless. All right, Pal One, when it comes to new love, what's coming in for you guys is amazing. We did not get a time frame because Spirit does not want you to know. All right, because we didn't even get a time frame over here with your tarot or over here in your this oracle deck that I created, <laughs> which I love. Bless. Um, I created it today for you guys. Um, I put time frames in here and I didn't get a time frame either. All right. So spirit doesn't really want you to know exactly when this person is coming in. But what they do want you to know is that your justice is coming in. All right. The scales will be balanced. All right. Right now you may be a little bit, um, you know, in this elusive, like cloudy, confused vibe with love. Okay. There may be an imbalance when it comes to love. But what Spirit wants you to know is that, baby, balance is coming for you. The universe is going to serve you. Something beautiful, something new is part of your journey. And this person is going to help you heal. This person is going to help you release an ex, someone from your life who hurt you tremendously. Because I'm seeing a lot of stress, a lot of overwhelming energies over this past lover, this past ex. All right, this bullshitter, okay? <laughs> That's why we got Janae Echo BS. All right, so this person is coming in to balance that scale and help you like cut cords with this past person. I see that your friends are going to help you. So maybe your friends will be around when you meet this person or they're just going to help you guide you along this new relationship, this new vibe, because this is definitely a new person. This is not a past person. I'm telling you that right now. I see you coming into this situation with a very open mind. And you're going to feel very victorious when you meet this person. It's going to feel very good. You're going to feel like a winner. And it's going to be really public. So I do feel like you guys will be very open about the relationship or very open about the connection. All right. This could be online or this could be in public. Okay. You're not going to hide it. It's going to be very, very open is what I'm seeing. You guys are definitely going to leap blindly into this relationship, not knowing what to expect. But what I'm seeing is that you've been going through a cycle, all right? Maybe this ex here could be the karmic that we pulled here. Um, and this person is destined to help you release this cord, okay? Because you are in some sort of cycle right now where you're learning about like self-love, cycles. You're learning a lot when it comes to your path and your destiny and self, all right? You are upgrading, you are ascending, you are growing, and this person is gonna help you, kind of give you a boost, 
boop, boop, and you're gonna fly. Kind of like when Mario from Mario Bros eats like a mushroom and he goes dum, 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 and he grows. All right, that's kind of the vibe here. This person is your mushroom, okay? And this person is gonna help you grow. This person is gonna help you cut cords with this past energy, um, which is coming off a little karmic to me, okay? Because it is it's time for you to release this person from your energy. This person has been in your energy, in your aura for far too long. All right, if you guys have been struggling financially, I see that as you heal and detox and step into this new connection, your finances, um your endeavors will open up okay that is also another message that i'm getting all right so there's blessings with your endeavors blessings with finances i'm also seeing that when this person comes in they're coming in with lots of love all right it's gonna be it's gonna feel so romantic okay it's gonna feel amazing this is definitely a new relationship this is gonna be a new start in your life you're gonna feel happiness happiness is coming home baby all right you're gonna feel like a new person and you're definitely going to be alone when you meet this person. I get a, a lot of alone vibes. You're definitely alone when you meet them. Um, meaning like you're not entertaining other people. You're not really um, committed to anyone. You're out here single and mingling and ready to have some fun. All right? And this person is coming in with a relationship. And it's going to feel very, very good. Now what I'm also seeing is that there's going to be other options for you to choose from. So it's really up to you, but what I see is that this person is destined and you're going to feel very attracted to them. You're going to feel like you're crossing a bridge with this person, like this person is helping you get from point A to point B and they're holding your hand along the way. They're going to be a light in your life. They're going to um, fill up your heart with love. Okay, no more blind energy, no more confused energy, no more what's going on, where is my person, what's happening here. Like, this is very beautiful and it's definitely, like, divine timing is destined for you. This person is going to be um, a little jealous, all right? They're going to be a little bit jealous, a little controlling, just so you know. Nothing that you can't handle, though, is, is, is chill, all right? They're just very possessive over what's theirs and they're going to be in love with you, so... They're going to show you that they really care. This person is a very, like, give, they give me extrovert, extrovert vibes. Yeah. It's like um, someone that likes to go out, has friends, um, has some sort of community. Okay. This person is friendly. This person is not, like, a loner. All right. This person is open to drink, to smoke, to have fun. Just be careful because sometimes they do lie, like, little white lies. But you will you will sniff it out, all right? Because you got, you guys are very intuitive. You guys are gonna sniff it out, and um, you're gonna feel really good, really calm when this person comes in because it's like it's not just them coming in. It's a lot of people coming towards you. I feel like the month of August is gonna be very abundant for you with love, all right? As far as like options opening up for you, and um, not saying that they're coming in August because they didn't give me a time frame. But I'm just letting you know, like, a lot of options are coming towards you in August. This could be one of them, all right? This person is very sexy, very attractive. A lot of people are um, attracted to your person, kind of like a moth to a flame, okay? So that is something that is going to have you a little bit edgy, okay? <laughs> I do see that this person is very flirty. They're going to want to flirt with you. They're going to they're gonna want to, like, make you feel... It's, it's like they're going to want to gas you up. All right, this person is going to want to make you feel good, want to make you feel beautiful, handsome, amazing, just overflowing you with love and compliments. Okay, this person is very generous as well, very smart, very organized. All right, so you're going to notice that this person likes to organize things in a certain way. Um, if you go to their home, you'll see that it's very organized or they have things in a certain order. They like to organize things in a really in a particular way. You'll see. Um, they're very particular about display or how things are organized and you're going to see this about the about your person as well um, The only thing is that because they're sexy they have a lot of options and i'm seeing that um, you know, they're they're gonna want to like Keep it under the wraps so that you don't feel intimidated or you don't feel like nervous or scared to date them I see that this person is a person that likes to go out and dance likes to have a good time kind of like the life of the party this person is very outgoing and um, you're going to learn a lot of lessons with this person. This person is here to take you on the next venture in your life, okay? And um, a lot of the reason why this person is also coming into your life is to help you release 
a past all right help you release this past person who was in your world this person from your past could be a twin flame or um i'm not getting a soulmate could be a twin flame for some of you guys i'm definitely getting that strongly um because you know like twin flames are very strong connections but not everybody gets the opportunity to settle down with their twin all right it's unfortunate you know it happens i have a twin all right so i'm speaking from personal experience all right um it's unfortunate but that doesn't mean that we don't have soulmates okay so those are also very special connections and i'm talking to my twins right now fyi um and that's kind of like what this person is coming in if you are like trying to cut cords with a twin this person is going to help you do that all right because they're going to fill up your cup with so much love and you're just going to feel so alive with this person and it's very refreshing is the vibe that i'm getting and you're going to cut that cord and um i'm definitely getting that this is a soulmate okay this is someone that um you may have a past life with this is someone that you're gonna resonate with immediately like you're gonna connect with this person you're gonna feel it right away this is not something that you're gonna question the only thing i see you questioning is possibly if this person is like flighty because they're sexy and they have a lot of options um but there's nothing there's nothing wrong with that i mean <laughs> You sexy, you got options, doesn't mean you want them, okay? <laughs> Shoot. Um, you know, and that's just um part of the lesson I feel like we're gonna also learn here with this connection, part one. All right, bless. So this is what's coming in for you guys. I wish I could give you a time frame. Let's see what comes out in your charmies, okay? Maybe a time frame comes in there. Um, but this is beautiful vibes, pa one, and this is what spirit wants you to know is coming towards you. A massive, strong, beautiful connection. Oh, we also have Libra here, which is Venus, all right? The love planet, okay? Bless. There's going to be a lot of happiness, a lot of joy, a lot of love. It's like you're basking in it. Like, there's so much of it. Like, you're going to feel like you're swimming in love. Yeah, this person is very attractive. Spirit wants you to know that, all right? Venus is, oof. Very, very sexy, attractive vibes. And they did come out sexy here, <laughs> okay? So you are going to be very attracted to this person. I'm getting a lot of passion. Lots of passion. And, like, you're just going to be like, oh, my gosh, what do I do? What do I do? Okay, bless. All right, let's go into your charmies. All right, guys, I am definitely going to do an extended as per the usual. In the extended, I'm going to just pull more about this person, this connection, and what the journey is going to be like. If we could get more clues, more indications, maybe even a time frame, okay? So um, that's going to be down below. I'm also going to get some advice, general advice for you guys. Um, we go deep, it gets juicy. The link for the extended is down below. It is the after party. So we are going to play All My Life, which is the song, the vibe for your new relationship, your new love. All right. Um, and um, I hope you guys meet me there. <laughs> Bless. Okay. All right. So let's get into these charms. Okay. So guys, if you're sensitive to noise, this is when you want to lower the volume because this gets really loud. All right. Ready, set, go. Ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel the charming for Pal One. Yeah, a lot of charmies here. Bless. Okay. Some initials for Pal One. All right, so we're going to do the charmies right now, babe. First, we're going to do story time with my story dice, okay? Bless. Um, this is that little bath bag that I put um, the bath salts and the roses for your spiritual bath, okay? The herbs come aside. It's a three-day bath. I have a bunch of them in my shop if you want to check it out. Power, powerful stuff, okay? Bless. All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels. Please come to and help me channel this message for part one. New love. Talk to me, spirit. Okay, um, I'm definitely seeing for some of you guys, children will be a factor. Maybe this person will have a child or you have children. Okay, so it's definitely coming through. I'm getting a gamer. So someone that likes to play video games or 
or maybe they watch video games. You know that new thing on YouTube, people watch people play video games, very interesting stuff. My son is hooked, all right? Um, but I do see communication, so you guys will be texters, you will be texting a lot. I do see you really happy, and this is coming in like as a surprise, and you're gonna be really, really surprised. I definitely see, like I said, this person is gonna help you heal from past hurts, is gonna help you um, process and cut cords with something very traumatic from your past, um, someone that really hurt you from your past. I see you coming down from the clouds, all right? So meaning like you're coming down, you're, you're like reaching a new level in your life, okay? And I see lots of fun. So I'm also getting some beach vibes, all right? So maybe you guys, like I did get beach vibes from the very beginning. So I'm feeling like some of you guys may meet this person at the beach or this person likes to go to the beach. They have a connection to the ocean, Yamaye energies. I'm seeing that, um, yeah, you guys are gonna have fun. And this person, like you're gonna meet this person while having fun. So you could be having fun in the beach or having fun with your friends. And I just see this person very attracted to you and they're gonna come towards you and it's gonna be like, surprise. Um, I definitely see, like I said, this person is meant to help you heal. They're going to open up new doors for you in romance and love. And you're climbing the ladder, meaning you're ascending. You're going to feel explosions of love, all right? And I'm seeing someone really upset about this. This could be possibly your ex or like hater raiders, maybe their ex or something. But you are going to feel so explosive, so happy. And just know that people are not going to be so happy about that. But who cares, all right? Um, I'm seeing that. Yeah, I'm getting children. Children are a factor here. There's something about a child. So for some of you guys, there's something about a child here. Children. All right. Um, You're going to find out something about this person's childhood. Okay. They're going to talk to you during dinner or a date. They're going to talk to you about their childhood. It's going to be very significant. So pay attention. Um, I'm also seeing that this person is a cuddler. They like to cuddle. All right. They like to nap. They like to rest. All right. They like vacations. I'm also seeing that you guys like you either meet them on a road trip or you're destined to go on a road trip with this person is like wish fulfillments coming true and um things are really going to be illuminated in your life okay i see you disconnecting from the internet disconnecting from people when you meet this person all right because you want to connect with them and you don't want distractions all right bless okay all right, so you may not want to expose the relationship right away is what I'm coming, I'm kind of, you know, social media stuff right away. You know, I'm getting that. All right, and this was story time with Jalissa. Bless. <laughs> All right, let's go into your charms. Let's go into your charms. Let's go. All right, bless. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let me organize this. Um, I don't channel messes, okay? I only channel coordination all right so give me a second let me just get this together and we're gonna go into your charms okay baby bless hello there if you're new to my channel welcome to the family all right baby bless i am so happy to have you here i hope that you guys are enjoying your time if so definitely join the family i would love for you to be my sister my brother all you have to do is um subscribe hit that bell button and bam you're part of the family. That's pretty much it. And let me let you know, besides the fact that you're going to have like a warm, very welcoming family that is very supportive, which is a blessing. There's no price on that. All right. Um, you'll also be part of my raffles. Every Monday, I'm baby Oprah. Every Monday, I'm giving away something to my family members. All right. This Monday coming up, I am giving away. Let me see. Yep, I'm giving away a strawberry shortcake affirmation deck along with a candle from my shop, Powerful Stuff, and a special gift on the side, which I, I'm not going to tell you. It's going to be a surprise. All right, so if you want to be part of the raffle, you have to be in it to win it. Subscribe and hit that bell button. Bless. All right, I'll talk more about that after the Charmies. Okay, hi, my OGs. How you guys doing, baby? Bless. Welcome. Okay, guys, I missed you guys. All right, let's go. All right, so guys, um, Spirit is letting me know when this person comes into your life, they may ride motorcycle, okay? Because you heard that big motorcycle energy right there, and they're coming in pretty fast is what Spirit wants you to know because motorcycles are fast. So um, rest assured that this person is coming in in the nick of time, and they're coming in fast. Um, They may ride bike. They may be about that bike life, okay? <laughs> um, But... What I'm seeing here is that when this person comes into your world, spirit wants you to know that you're going to be in a very vulnerable state. OK, so I see you like trying to hold on to something um, and trying to release it at the same time, which is um, 
putting you in a vulnerable energy so you have like an attachment to something that you need to release and you're having a difficult time doing it when this person comes in i'm seeing also that you're going to be in a very bored energy when this person comes into your life all right like you're going to be bored kind of like oh i need some excitement in my life all right i see internet all right so for some of you guys you may meet this person online social media maybe they already saw you on social media they're lurking on you okay they're like keeping their eye on you probably waiting for that right moment to come in all right so don't post anything about being in love with someone else okay bless <laughs> um i'm also seeing that you're when this person comes in you're very nostalgic about a soulmate or a twin flame from your past all right you're still thinking about this person you're kind of like stuck in the past and that's why spirit is bringing this person into your world and it's going to be massive energy so they're really going to help you get away from this past energy which it which was meant to teach you something all right and um it's time to cut cords is what spirit is saying it's time to cut cords. I see um, that this person, when they come in, they're going to be very fair. They're going to be, they're going to want to be peaceful, fair with you. All right. They're going to help you move on. Like there's big energy about moving on from the past and hope is returning back to your home. I see you recovering with this person and I see that um, they're going to help you also release some sort of paranoia or like this energy of feeling like you always have to be defending yourself or defensive. All right, so you're going to release all this energy, that, which is beautiful. And you guys are going to tap into like a higher vibe, ascending, bless. All right, so this could be yours or their um, first, middle, last initial, okay? We have V, X, Y, P, G, Y, K, S, N, U, S. All right, so maybe they're from the United States, all right? I am getting the sun a lot, a lot about sun energy. And remember, the sun is like, wow, such a powerful planet. It's the planet of success, is the planet of happiness, good health, happy marriage. All right. So there's a lot of sun energy here. So a lot of happiness coming in. All right. H I. Yeah, this person's definitely going to reach out to you or come towards you and say hi. All right. B K. They could be from Brooklyn. All right. We have N N Y W. R J V W K P H S F Z Z U. All right. Now, as far as charmies go, you guys are gonna like be very shy about like how y'all feel about each other, but this is really gonna go deep. All right. So you guys on the surface are not gonna want to like immediately express how you feel about each other, you and this new person. But there is gonna deep there is gonna be deep vibes here, is what spirit is saying. All right, so you're gonna feel love for this person. This person is also gonna feel love for you. That's why I'm telling you, their offer, their commitment, their relate the relationship they're offering you is gonna be full of love. They're coming in with a lot of love. And you're gonna feel it, but you're not gonna express it right away. And they're gonna feel it, but they're not gonna express it right away. It's like you guys are like nervous to express how deep or how much you feel each other. All right, I see you being brave when you take this leap of faith with this person. All right, you're, this person that's coming in is going to inspire you. All right, this person is going to um, open up your mind to new possibilities, new doors. And um, yes, there is a definitely, there's definitely a strong connection here. So this could be like a soulmate, um, but you're going to have a divine connection with this person is what I'm seeing. All right, and there's a lot of snacks here. So I definitely feel like um, your person is going to be very sweet. All right, they're going to see you as a snack too. Very delicious, very good looking person. Hello. All right, money bags are here. All right, so finances are going to be going up when this person comes into your world. Remember, as your vibe raises, so does everything else around you. So as you're vibing in a higher vibration, you open up new doors. So I'm seeing you opening up new doors even with finances. All right, you're going to be cleaning up your life when this person comes in. A lot of healing happening. And you are my sunshine. Again, more sun energy. You are definitely going to be this person's sunshine. They're going to be your sunshine. It's just a lot of happy, beautiful vibes coming on here for reals. All right, I see that this person, um, yeah, is like, um, mm -hmm. you guys are going to speak to a sister, brother, friends, whoever is very close to you that you speak to and you open up to. You're going to speak to them about this connection and how you feel. 
yeah there's a your friends your your family someone close to you is going to help you with this connection they're going to give you great advice and we have basketball here all right so this person could play basketball or likes to play video games or watch basketball watch sports play sports an athlete all right that's a possibility out here uh -huh. as far as signs go we have capricorn virgo we did get Capricorn. We did get Virgo in your reading. So I feel like there's going to be strong Capricorn Virgo energies. Um, we also have Gemini and we have Pisces. Okay. So that could be in their chart or be their sign as well. All right, baby. Bless. Bless. All right. So let's get into this pendulum. All right. Think of a question you may want to ask spirit today. We're going to swing this and I'm going to talk about the Charmies as this. I mean, we're going to talk about the raffle as this swings. Okay. So, Spirit, what is the answer for Pawan? All right, baby. All right, so guys, as you know, I am Baby Oprah. So Monday, I am giving away this beautiful Strawberry Shortcake Affirmation Deck along with a candle from my shop. I choose one intuitively for you, okay? And um, an extra gift on the side, which I'm not going to tell you is going to be a surprise. That's the exciting part. All you have to do to be part of the raffle, babe, is subscribe, hit that bell button. And the sponsor to this deck is Lilac and Lavender Moon. She creates so many decks. All right, so she gave me all these decks for my family. And all she wants is family, all right? So she wants a follow on Instagram. So subscribe, hit that bell button, and follow Lilac and Lavender Moon on Instagram. And bam, you are in it to win it, baby. Okay, bless. My Instagram, if you want to be friends, which I would love, is J-U-1-I-Z-Z-A. All right, you can find me on Instagram. Let's be friends. Let's be homies. All right, guys, bless. I post the winner on my community board Monday night or Tuesday morning. So definitely look out for that here on YouTube. But I also post it on Instagram. So I posted on um, both engines. All right, and we have here, yes. All right, bless. Your answer is yes. All right, guys, so um, now I'm going to go off to the extended and I'm going to get more info about this connection, this beautiful vibe. I'm going to play Casey and Jojo as I shuffle and we're going to see what else spirit wants you to know about this connection, what's coming, what's going, what's happening, what else, what clues we can pull. All right, I'm going to get more, um, details. I have a bunch of details in here like that will help you, um, identify who this person is and what is coming. Okay. And um, I'm going to get advice from the universe just for you, Paul One, from the angels, your universe, your ancient ancestors. The link for that is down below in the description. I hope to meet you there. If so, definitely give me a minute, babe. I will be there right now. Bless. Paul One, if this is where we're parting ways, I just want to say I love you. You guys are amazing. You guys are doing great on your path. Remember, you are different, you are unique, and that is your superpower. All right, baby? And always have that open mind for something fresh, a new door to open up, because that is exactly what's happening for you guys in love. And I love you guys so much. If you enjoyed today's reading, please give it a thumbs up, as it does help the channel, and it helps me, and I totally appreciate that. I love you. Bless. Hello to my sisters and my brothers, my new sisters and brothers. What's up? How you doing, bae? Welcome to the family. All right, guys, make sure to hit that bell button after you subscribe, and good luck to you guys with the raffle. All right, my OGs, you already know what time it is. I love you guys. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in the comments, and I'm wishing you guys all the best. All right, baby? Mwah. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah. Deuces. Bless. Catch you in the next one. Hey, Patu. Welcome to your reading. Bless. Thank you so much, guys, for being here with me today. Let's get it. Let's go. Okay. Guys, as soon as I tapped into y'all energies, I got butterflies. Are you guys nervous? Okay, let me know. Because if not, then you're just going to be nervous when this comes. All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for part two. Spirit, part two, I always, I don't know what it is with part two. It's always with part two. I always get so excited to start part two that I always forget to put Pal 2 sticker, okay? I don't know. I'm, I was just like ready to go in and I didn't even pull your sticker, all right? But there it goes. Let's get it. So what is the angel number for Pal 2? I don't know. I always get so excited. I always forget to put Pal 2 stickers. It's just like, I don't know. It's a vibe. <laughs> all right, Pal 2, your angel number is 6124, okay? 6124, go on to Google, put 6124, angel number meaning, and bam, there goes your message from Spirit, baby. Bless. Okay. 
All right, so let's go. Let's get into this. New love. What's coming? What's going? What's happening, baby? All right, pal tool, we got here the sun, which is a very powerful energy. Let's talk about it. All right, the sun is the center of our universe. Okay. It is the planet that all planets revolve around. Okay, the sun is success, happiness, joy. All right, the sun is powerful. The sun is also happy marriage vibes. Okay, let's talk about that. But you are my sunshine. So you're definitely going to be feeling really happy in this new relationship, this new connection, this new love is what I'm getting. It's going to feel massive. It's going to feel powerful. It's going to feel really successful is what I'm getting. Okay, that is the vibe. Bless. Okay, let's go into it. Part two. First, we're going to pull an affirmation for you guys, and then we're going to get into y'all reading. Okay, so let's see what spirit wants you to know wants you to remind you yourself of every day okay it's very ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through help me channel this message for pal two all right spirit spirit what is pal two's affirmation for today all right big affirmation energies i don't know ever since we entered this new like energy on july 1st i've been on an affirmation wave all right so affirmations are a big deal right now is what i'm getting Strong vibes on, on affirmation. So let's see. Spirit, what is Paul 1's affirmation for today? We have good things keep happening to me with this beautiful rainbow. All right? Yes. Bless. All right? You know, I usually say this, but if you're new, here we go. All right? After the rain comes the rainbows. Okay? Bless. And I see you jumping with joy. Okay? So Spirit wants you to, rem wants you to remind yourself on a daily basis. Good things keep happening to me. What? I am blessed okay let's put that there and then we also have i have unlimited potential that i tap into every day i have unlimited potential that i tap into every day you guys are powerful you have a lot of potential and spirit wants you to tap into this every day because you guys are moving forward Mhm. Mm moving forward is what i'm seeing so spirit wants you to remind yourself all right Plug that in, okay? You're full of potential, and a lot of good things are going to keep happening for you. Oh, God bless. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through. Help me channel this message for Pal 2. Pal 2, my new music deck. My new music deck is coming on Monday. Bless, all right? Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels. I'm so excited. New music, more music, beautiful design. I can't wait to premiere it. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, um, Spirit, talk to me. What is the vibe for new love with Pal 2? Talk to me about it. Okay, we have <laughs> Bless 112 Cupid. Girl, if I told you I love you, that doesn't mean that I don't care. Oh, and when I tell you I need you, don't think that I'll never be there. Oh, baby, I'm so tired of the way you turn my words into deception and lies. Don't misunderstand me when I try to speak my mind. I'm only saying what's in my heart. Ooh. All right, so, part to listen, okay? So, this is Cupid. So, Cupid is out here letting you know that they are striking you and your person, all right? Meant to be type of vibes, 112 Cupid, um, in your new relationship, your new love, okay? So, you guys will be striked by Cupid. This is like so many energies for a fact. Okay, um, Dustin, this is Dustin to be. Now, this person is going to tell you that they love you and they are going to tell you that they care and that they're going to be there for you. But for some reason, you're going to be a bit doubtful, okay? Maybe this is because of past events, history, you know, a little bit of the past coming and creeping into the future. Doubt, maybe you're going to tell them that they're being deceptive because of something you've went through or, you know, like they're kind of moving in the same way as someone else and it's a little bit, you know scary all right but spirit is out here letting you know that this person is going to be very transparent and very direct they're going to be very assertive when it comes to what they say what they want and where they're going all right you may have dealt with a lot of flighty people pal too but this person coming in is going to be very assertive they're going to be very straight up and they're not going to play any games with you all right <laughs> destiny's child dangerously in love okay Baby, I love you. You are my life. My happiest moments were incomplete if you weren't by my side. You're my relation and connection to the sun. 
The sun. And what is your sticker? The sun. Okay, yeah, I'm excited. Okay. Um, you next to me, there's no darkness I can't overcome. You are my raindrops. I am the sea. What did I say? After the rain comes the rainbows. I'm so excited. Okay. You are the raindrops. I am the sea. Okay. You and God, who's my sunlight, I'm blooming. Grown so beautifully. Baby, I'm so proud, proud to be your girl or man. You make the confusion go all away from this cold, misty world. Ooh. All right, so Patsu, listen, there's no love. You're going to be dangerously in love with this person. They're going to feel the same energy as you. You guys are both going to be hit by Cupid, and this is nothing but rainbows, okay? Yeah, there was a little shower, but you needed the shower in order to get the rainbow. So happiness is coming in. The sun is really here for you guys, which is success, happiness, and goals, okay? <laughs> goals. I want this. Hello? I mean, not that i don't have it but you know what i'm saying <laughs> this is what people want all right let's go all right let's go let's go all right let's see what's coming all right spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through help me channel this message for pal two spirit talk to me about pal two for my singles what's going on what love is coming into their world what do they need to know what's happening what's going on talk to me Ooh, talk to me all right, spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through. Help me channel this message for Pal 2. All right, spirit, talk to me about Pal 2, this new love, what's happening, what's going, what's coming, what's, what's happening, what's going on for Pal 2 with new love. All right, we have the Two of Cups, soulmate vibes. I told you, I know what I be seeing. I know, I know, I know. Mm -hmm. This is definitely a soulmate, baby. That's coming into your worlds. All right, we have Three of Swords. We have the Knight of Pentacles, okay? We're going to talk about it. Mm -hmm. I know why that Three of Swords is there, okay? We have the Page of Swords, okay? So, yes, yes, I see that. Mm -hmm. Exactly what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Yep, Caterpillar turning into a butterfly. Mm -hmm. And we have the Universe, Bless. Yes, I love this energy. With... The six of cups in the back of the deck. All right, could we talk about this soulmate, though? This is like strong soulmate energies. You guys have a past life with this person, all right? So you had a past life with them. This is not the first go around with your person, pal two. Okay, so this is someone you will recognize. Your soul is going to recognize this person right away. You're going to feel very comfortable with this person. Mm-hmm. Meant to be energies. All right, I'm getting a contract here. Definitely have a contract with this person. Uh huh. This person is a big thinker too. Someone that's into like finding out knowledge. All right. Someone that's into like finding out about the universe, universal laws, crystals, healing, all that sorts of stuff. They're gonna be interested in this. All right. So spirit, talk to me about Paltu's new love. Talk to me about this new love energy. All right, we have the world, which is the universe right here. Mm -hmm. And then back of the deck, we have woman holding a coin. Oh, yeah. Talk to me about Pal 2. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's go. You guys are releasing someone when you meet this person. Mm -hmm. You're releasing a past person when you, release, when you find this person. All right, so spirit. Talk to me about Pal 2. New love, new love, Pal 2. We have very soon, all right? So this is happening in the now now, all right? Very soon, very, very soon. You're going to have to make up your mind. You're going to let go of this ex or what, okay? And we have reconciliation. And this, what I'm getting this as, I'm not getting this as reconciliation with a past person. This is someone from your past life. They're returning back into your life now, in this time, in this lifetime. Mm-hmm. You guys are really, really going to recognize each other. There's a lot of romance, a lot of passion mm -hmm. and we have religious factors like i said you guys are soulmates this is a very strong connection true love true love love yes baby talk to me about it mm -hmm. this is the romance of a lifetime yes baby okay let's go <laughs> spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through help me channel this message here for pal two all right uh-huh okay 
All right, Spirit, talk to me about Pau 2, their new person, this new relationship, this new connection, what's happening, what's going, what's going on, what's happening, what can they expect? All right. All right, this person's going to be a little bit of a liar. Hmm. <laughs> They're an introvert, okay? All right, we have Twin Flame, all right? So this could be your this could be a Twin Flame, okay? Twin Flame connect especially with all this past life energy, all right? So this is a Twin Flame. We have mommy issues, all right? So this person um has some sort of mommy issues, all right? That's coming out here. We have player. We have just a good time, okay? Let's go. We have sexy. We have Capricorn, okay? What else? We have Pisces. Alright. Mm. We have airport. Alright. So there could be some traveling here. You can meet this person during travels. We have 50 shades of gray. Lots of passion. Sexy vibes. We have long hair. Alright. So your person could have long hair. Um, or maybe you do. We have funny sense of humor. So this person is going to be very funny. All right. And we have Aquarius. So we have Capricorn, Pisces, Aquarius. Let's get into this. Okay. So spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pau 2. Spirit, talk to me about Pau 2. There's new love coming into their world. All right. All right. So Pau 2, this is a strong connection that's coming in. Okay. There's going to be cycles, and I ain't going to hold you, all right? I'm very honest. I'm very, very honest. This is definitely a soulmate twin flame. Soulmate twin flame connection. Strong soulmate or a strong twin flame connection. This is real, all right? There's a lot of religious factors coming into play in this connection. And it's happening very soon. All right, what I'm seeing is that there's new love that's coming in. It is true love. All right, this person does have a lot of shadows, though. I'm not going to hold you, all right? So I'm going to give you it, and I'm going to give it to you raw. It's a blessing. It's meant to come into your life. You're definitely going to feel very romantic with this person. It's coming in soon. You're going to feel very passionate with this person. There's, like, lots of passion, lots and lots of passion. All right, for some of you guys, this person may have status, okay? Um, that's going to be for some though. I'm getting a status vibe. Someone that has clout or someone that has a lot of money, someone that has status. Um, this is going to take you for a ride and this is going to last you a very long time. All right. So meaning you're going to be in this connection for quite some time. This is not going to be an in and out type of situation. I do see that, um, you're going to be really happy with this person. You guys have a past life together and, um, you're going to feel like this is a romance of a lifetime, okay? Um, this person is coming back to you. So this is someone from a past life that you had a connection, a relationship with in a different lifetime. This person is coming back, all right? It's coming back around. You guys are going to work out some sort of karma. Now, what I'm seeing is that whatever this karma is that you guys are paying or working out, involves your person having some mommy issues and being a bit of a player all right um yeah flighty energies your person is going to be a bit of a liar all right they're an introvert meaning that they like to be alone they don't like to be in big circles they're not really that person that's going to be like the life of the party all right they're going to be like in their own little bubble they're the type of person that will watch you a lot, watch your social media, watch you in general, um, keep a very close eye on you, try to like observe you, understand you, understand like how you flow, certain things like that. I do see that your person is going to be very um, outspoken, all right? They're going to speak their mind. They're going to tell you like what they want, where they're going, what they feel, all right? There's a lot of delays here is what I'm saying too. There's going to be a little bit of a disappointing energy because I do see with this three of swords that this person is going to be a cheater. All right. This person is going to cheat on you. Um, This person, that's the bad news. All right. Um, mm -hmm, It's like minor setbacks. All right. And I'm seeing that it may be with either a, a person that they have a child with or um, maybe cheat. Um, 
and there could be a child okay so that is like some sucky news but i have to give it to you i'm giving it to you raw and um what i'm seeing is that this person is actually here in your life because they're meant to be there's a lot of lessons that you're gonna learn with this person um so it's gonna feel like a roller coaster there's gonna be big highs because you guys are really solely connected and the vibe here the passion the love the sex everything is gonna be so amazing all right but then there's the issues with mommy all right so this person could have abandonment issue co um codependency issues is what i'm getting and those issues is what leads your person into this player energy it's not that you're not enough it's not that they don't love you because there is going to be massive love here all right this person's going to want to take it very slow with you they're not going to want to like hop into marriage they're not going to want to like you know speed up things all the way and you know settle down and have a family right away um this person's going to want to take it very slow with you they're going to want to get to know you they're very very cautious about who they're dating what they're going to do with their life all right because they've been burned in the past this person has a lot of trauma a lot of issues from the past that they're still holding in their aura in their energy that they need to heal and that's where that player energy comes in it's not like they're playing because they're not happy or they're not satisfied at home or with you it's like they're playing to feed some sort of ego to like make sure that like it's like an ego thing where they need to feed the ego in order to feel comfortable with self or feel reassured that they are good enough all right they have a lot of self-esteem issues a very low self-esteem insecure energies they are a bit jealous and they are very possessive so they're going to be really like um possessive over you they're not going to want you with anyone else you know even though they have this player energy they're not going to want you to do anything with anyone else, all right? They're really, really an introvert. So they don't really have, like, a lot of friends. They may know a lot of people, but that doesn't mean they have a lot of friends, all right? They like to stay home, Netflix and chill, video games, stuff like that. Um, They do lie because um they need to get away with what they're doing. So there is going to be a lot of white lies is what I'm seeing. Um, They're also in this dreamy energy, all right? So... They're big dreamers. They like to they 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 like to dream up their future, all right? And they're never really sure about what's going to happen, but they do take leaps of faith, all right? But they're also very cautious. So it's like someone that is dreaming of a big future, but then they're kind of crawling towards it because they're scared. So they want to take the leap. They're optimistic. They're open-minded. They're going towards it, but they're doing it very slowly. This person is very cautious, all right? Um... I'm seeing that um, you guys may meet this person in an airport or during travels, all right? So you guys may not live in the same area. I'm seeing that um, for some of you guys, this person may have long hair or longish hair. Like, I don't see a Caesar. You know, a Caesar is a very low cut. I don't see that. I'm seeing someone that has, like, either a little fro or a little bit of hair, you know, a little swoop on the side or long hair, braids, however it goes. Um, but they have hair, Okay. And they're going to come off as if they just want a good time, but that's not all it is. You guys are definitely going to be in this connection for quite some time. A lot of learning, a lot of lesson. This is like some karma that's being paid. It could be um, on both sides is what I'm seeing. But I do see that you guys are going to enter a new level in your life when this person comes in. All right, this person is going to help you push forward. All right, they're going to help you trump over your difficulties. They're going to help you reach achievements. They're going to help you become successful. And there is going to be happiness here. It's not, you know, like, oh, wow, this person is going to come in and hurt me and break my heart. Yes, they're going to hurt you a little bit with this player energy. Um, but spirit is letting you know why they're a player. I'm not justifying it because I don't like that. All right. I don't I don't I don't play with that energy. All right. But this is why I'm explaining why this person is the way they are and what's going to happen out of this. I definitely see you guys becoming very successful aside, like next to this person. Like this person is going to help you become very successful. A lot of money coming in, a lot of abundance. All right, so there is a lot of success coming out of this relationship. You guys are going to partner up and help each other rise. You're going to help them heal their mommy issues. You're going to help them heal this player energy and rise above that. And they're going to help you rise above like your self-worth your self-care and um traumas from your past all right they're gonna help you heal as well even though they're gonna 
kind of break your heart a little bit there you know i can't lie about that i can't like disregard that but they are gonna help you heal like whatever they put you through is gonna actually build you not break you um is what i'm seeing here but this is massive energies like i said this is a strong soulmate or twin flame and this person is here to help you with your path and this is really gonna bring in a lot of blessings believe it or not this is true love all right this is true love it's gonna be a bit difficult is what spirit is letting you know um but don't disregard that you know this isn't love because this person cheated on me all right um that's just a trauma that's just a shadow that your person has to overcome and heal and that's what you're coming into their world for to help them heal this energy help them overcome these issues and on the other hand they're going to help you with other things um like becoming successful becoming grounded becoming um abundance all right lots of money there's a lot of success that is coming out of this connection but it's going to take a while and spirit wants you to know that all right but is it a soulmate twin flame it definitely is is it going to be massive yes is it going to be strong yes is it going to be passionate of course sexy vibes oof off the chains all right love energy passionate loving beautiful kisses it's going to be a vibe and that's why it's going to hurt you when this person hurts you because you're going to be so deeply in love into this person in a, on a soul level all right soul connections are very deep and that's what you have here with this new love coming into your world they're going to want to fix things with you. They're going to want to make things right with you. All right. And they're going to help you get to the next level in your life. All right. Bless. Woof. That is a lot. Okay. It is a lot. I know it's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. But it's like, it's going to change your life is what spirit is saying. This is going to change your life for the better, not for the worse. All right. If you could just overcome these obstacles with them with the player energy and the cheating and confront that and be very assertive with them and you know work with that energy um I, you guys are gonna have everything with this person you're gonna help them all right they have issues with love abandonment issues all right codependency issues like they get attached to things and it's difficult for them to let go is what i'm seeing yeah they have cheating issues yeah um, but spirit is saying, um, yes, yeah, seven of swords with temperance though. Like, yes, this person is going to be a bit of a liar. They're going to be very flighty. They're not going to be a hundred percent honest with you. Um, but spirit is saying with temperance in time, you guys will heal this in time with patience and being optimistic. You guys will heal this. You guys will compromise and there will be balance. A lot of healing is happening in this connection. All right. So I want you to know that it's not going to be like that forever or it, like it's not going to continuously happen. It's going to be something that needs to be addressed. It needs to happen in order for it to be addressed. And that's what's going to happen. It's going to happen. You're going to address it and then you're going to deal with it, heal it. And you guys are going to grow and build and build into something very massive and amazing. All right. Bless. Let's go into the charms. This is intense. Let me know. Okay. They didn't give me a time frame. All right. So I, I, I'm, I'm going to do an extended. All right, guys. So if you want, join me in the extended if you want more details. I'm going to play 112 Cupid in the extended as I shuffle. I'm going to get more details about you, your person, what's going to happen, how it's going to happen, what to expect, everything. And um, what, uh, well, everything that spirit wants you to know, you know? And I'm going to get some advice and guidance from the universe as to what you should do, how you should maneuver around this situation, and um, in general advice as well. Okay, so if you want to join me, um, it'll be very beneficial if you want to know more. The link for that is down below, okay, because this is like deep energies, okay? This is not like, oh, oh, that was fun. No, this is like life-changing energies, pal too. All right, let's go. All right, Spirit, Um, listen, this gets really loud. If you're sensitive to noise, you may want to lower the volume now. All right, ready, set, go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spirit guys, angels, please come through and help me channel the message for Pal 2. Spirit, talk to me, charming for Pal 2. We got new charmings. Oh, hold up. Hold up, Pal 2. Do not leave me. This is going to be worth your while. Hold on. Ooh. 
Yeah, baby. I don't know, Pa One is gonna be so mad at me <laughs> because I didn't do it for them, but I'm doing it for you. I don't know, I was guided to. I forgot all about this for Pa One, but I guess their message doesn't include what I'm about to add, all right? So give me a sec, guys. Super exciting stuff, all right? Because I got new charms. And I totally forgot to, like, um, put it in prior to the readings because, um, you know, I just forgot. I'm human. Um, <laughs> but Spirit was like, um, excuse me, there's messages for them over there and go get that. So I was like, okay, I'm sorry, my bad. All right, so let me just add these charmies real quick before we get into this. What's this? Oh, it broke. Oh, the fishbowl broke. Oh, it's all right. Let me just get that out of there because I don't want to cut myself. All right, we're having a moment. Whatever. I'll find it. The fishbowl broke. I, I wonder how. Anyway. I oh, know this one is for guys while I'm doing this. Let me just tell you guys what I'm excited about. I'm excited because I am doing a new candle. <laughs> I'm always starting something. And the new candle is a birthday candle. <laughs> Bless. All right, so we're going to have a birthday candle. It's going to be so pretty. It's going to look like a cake. It's going to have sprinkles, all that good stuff. It's going to be birthday vibes for sure. And... It's coming, like, within the next few weeks, like, a week or two. I need to first create it, then, you know, premiere it, whatever, whatever. And um, that's going to be super exciting. I can't wait to show you guys that one. And it's going to be a Make-A-Wish candle, um, but normal size. So I have a large Make-A-Wish candle. And this one is going to be a normal size. And it's going to be a birthday one. So it's good for, like, gifting somebody on their birthday, you know. Like, happy birthday, here's a candle, make a wish, like, for real, though. Like, you know, not just, not that, you know, those wishes we make with our cakes are not real, but this is going to be a powerful wish. Like, make your wish for real, and here you go. It could be a great gift for self, for your birthday, you know? Look at that. Baby tarot, yeah. <laughs> More new baby tarot. Uh-huh. So let's go. This is the last one. I know, right? Match armies. I went in. I was shopping and I was like, oh, I found all these little fi these little figurines. And I was like, oh my God, this is so cute. This will be great for my readings. <laughs> all right. So there we go, Pal 2. Thank you for being patient with me. Now we're going to see what you guys get. Because apparently there's something that needed to be pulled from that bunch of new charmies all right so let's go if you're sensitive to noise lower the volume all right baby ready set go service ancestors universe oh snapples oh snapples <laughs> okay all right, we got some new charms. Let's see what the new charms are. All right, so first of all, I'm gonna do this after the story time. So let's first do story time and then we're gonna go into your new charmies. Okay, let me get some initials, initials for part two. All right, let's do story time real quick. This is my bath bag. I put my bath salts and my rose petals in here. And then on the side, I put the herbs. This is a three-day bath. It's in my shop. If you guys want a bath for love, protection, healing, abundance, go check it out. Links down below. Spirit, talk to me about part two, new love, what they need to know. We got the sun again. You're going to be so happy, though. Like, I'm not going to hold you. All right, so you know what it is? There's a karmic in this person's life that um they need to cut cords with this is where like that cheating energy comes into play all right so you're gonna find out about karmic in this person's life that they need to release and um you're gonna be really surprised with this person because they are gonna make you very happy and um this karmic whoever it is you're gonna be like what like please okay this person is going if you have social media this person is definitely following you or going to be following you they're gonna like your pictures or they like your picture or something like that like they see your picture there's something about a picture following you and a picture um and they're gonna want to open up that door with you 
all right i'm seeing that yeah there is a flight here so you guys may like i'm getting a lot of energy revolving airport airplanes all right so you may meet this person during travels or that or during um this person could be traveling in your city or you're traveling in their city or you you meet them in the airport but this is where it's going down all right during travels or this person traveling um in your look we have so many airplanes there's a lot of airplanes all right this person doesn't live near you all right there's so much travel all right you guys are manifesting some of you guys are manifesting a baby um i definitely see a commitment that you're manifesting marriage I want you to know that we got a lot of baby energy in your charmings, FYI. We're going to go into that, but I see manifestations around commitment, babies, stuff like that. And Spirit is letting you know that they got your order, okay? It's cooking right now. I see um, things being illuminated in your life. I see you having fun. I definitely see some sexy time, a lot of passion. I see you guys going out to dance. I see you guys very excited, very geeked, all right, you guys? I see you guys writing in a journal or writing down, like, this blessing that has come into your life, all right? So maybe you write down your manifestations, but you're going to be super excited, super happy about this gift, this blessing, and you're going to be writing it down or something like that. I definitely see that a great idea is coming towards you, and um, it's a wish fulfillment, okay? Something about online. A great idea about online is coming towards you and is a wish fulfillment, don't disregard it you are gonna get a notification that's gonna make you sing okay there is a this person i guess they're gonna contact you or or hit you up and you're gonna be so happy you're gonna be singing i see you guys healing and divine timing is on the table with children or a child so for those who are manifesting a baby or a child just know that divine timing is on the table and um there's a need to heal all right healing is necessary okay and this was story time with Jalissa. bless <laughs> all right let's go let's get into the charms we have a lot going on here today okay i have to organize this first though i can't just channel like that i i channel in a certain order so give me a moment as i clear up look the broken glass came here as i clear up this energy all right hello there how you guys doing baby i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are blessed if you're new to my channel welcome welcome to the family boo i'm so happy to have you here look the sun all this sun energy is such a beautiful vibes all right um i'm so happy to have you guys here bless um guys if you are enjoying your time here with me definitely consider staying okay subscribe hit that bell button i'm here for you okay i love I love inviting new family members and welcoming new family members into my home, okay? So definitely, I would love to have you. Also, by the way, I am baby Oprah. <laughs> yes, I said baby Oprah. I'm out here giving gifts to the world, okay? Every Monday, I'm giving something away, okay? I'm giving something away. This Monday coming up, I'm giving away my strawberry shortcake affirmation deck. I am giving away a candle from my shop, which I will choose intuitively for you. And I'm also giving away a special something on the side. But I'm not saying it because that's 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 the perk. It's a surprise, okay? Oh, okay. All right. Um, and all you have to do to be part of the raffle is be in it to win it. All right. So you got to subscribe, hit that bell button. All right. Bless. Now, um, I post, I'm going to talk more about that after the charmies. All right, guys. So let's get into this because I'm excited. Hi, my OGs. How we doing, bae? <laughs> talk to me about the baby charmies. Ew. Yes, your girl's always trying to upgrade stuff over here. You know what I'm saying? Um, never gets old. Never gets old. All right, guys, um, with this sharded glass, this glass that broke from the fishbowl that ended up here in y'all reading, I'm definitely getting, like, there is some shadows that need to be healed. So you guys need, like, a protection bath or a protection candle. Um, You could go to your local spiritual store and get one, or you could go to my shop and get one. But broken glass always signifies some sort of bad luck. Um, So you want to, like, protect your energy, okay, is what I'm getting off the bat all right now let's go into this when this person comes into your world i'm seeing that um wow you're gonna be in this energy of like your energy is not gonna be like flowing consistently all right there's a little chaos in your world when this person comes in you're gonna be a little destructive when it comes to your energy not saying that you're doing destructive stuff um 
um but it's kind of like your energy is going to be in balance when this person comes in and i'm seeing it's because you feel like like there's like bad luck or like things are just out of control they're not going the way you want them to go you just feel stuck in a certain situation or stuck in general in life like things are not really going your way all right this is was this is the vibe you're gonna have when this person comes in and they're coming in with big sun energy okay they're coming in with all this happiness all this joy bringing in this optimistic energy towards your world where you're going to sense more success more happiness you're going to be feeling good you're going to see this person and think like wow i could marry this person i could see me i could see myself having a child with this person you know it's going to feel really good really happy really amazing but there is a third party situation that's going to be um also present during the time that this person comes in meaning that they're going to have someone from their past, a karmic, that they're still either entertaining or talking to, um, kind of like cheating with in a sense. They're going to cheat on this karmic with you and fall in love with you, all right? But um, it's coming in and you're not going to know about it immediately, but I'm warning you and I'm telling you, so you're going to have your you know, antennas up for this, okay? I see a lot of anxiety over some sort of third party situation and I see like this person lying, not telling you the truth, being dishonest and it's going to cause some stress is what I'm seeing. I'm seeing that your energy is going to be a bit depleted. You're going to feel a bit vulnerable. You're going to be feeling like you don't have much control, like you want to control them, but you don't have that control over them. And um, you're just going to feel like this person is like self-sabotaging in their relationships and self-sabotaging in your connection. Like they're not acting right. All right. But as far as like passion and like happiness and energies and what they're bringing towards you, you're going to be very attracted to that. You're going to be very attracted to their love language, their passion, their sex appeal, their their they have a Venus energy. OK, so they may have Libra in their chart or they may be Libra. All right, they're going to have this Venus energy, which is like powerful love energies. All right, this blissful love energy. But at the same time, um, then there's this little drama that you're going to have to deal with. All right. So let's go into initials first, middle, last. This could be yours or theirs. We have S, P, W, P, V, S, N, C, J, Z, U, D. L B N R G Y Z N K X Y V P S L E X U. All right. Yeah. I'm getting Los Angeles. I don't know for some reason, I'm really getting that like Los Angeles energy, LA, Cali. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right. Let's go into the charmies. So there's a lot here. All right. This person is going to want to put all their eggs in your basket, despite the fact that there's someone else. Like, that doesn't mean that they're not going to want to put all their eggs in your basket. They're not going to want to settle with you because that's what I'm seeing, that this person is going to want to settle with you. But um, because they're insecure, they have low self-esteem, low and they're very like they have this low vibe. Um, I feel like they hold on to certain things, kind of like a just in case energy, just in case it doesn't work out. Like I have something to fall back on, which is not an excuse, which is not good. But I'm explaining to you why there is a third party, even though they want to put all their eggs in your basket. OK, so this person has a lot of healing to do. All right. Self-worth energies. We have cola. So definitely this person may be into like drinking cold cola sodas, but I definitely feel like there's going to be a lot of tea to this story, mm -hmm. meaning a lot of gossip, a lot of like talks. I definitely see you guys healing, cleaning up your homes when you meet this person. All right. Like I said, there is going to be a lot of tea. All right. Hot tea. All right. So a lot of gossip, a lot of energy, a lot of energy around gossip and people like talking about your person, talking about your connection. You you may have someone reach out to you, something like that. Like it's going to be a little dramatic. OK, but nothing you can't handle because I do see you guys getting over it. All right. I do see that this person is going to help you ascend to get to the next level in your life and that this is going to be big love energy. Mm hmm. I see that this person, you're going to meet them through Messenger. So they're either going to find you online or they're going to find like, I don't know, your information some way, somehow, and they're going to contact you. 
because there's strong communications coming in now we have a baby okay so like you guys are some of you guys are manifesting a baby or you know having babies and that is definitely here and what spirit is letting me know um if possible you guys are gonna have a boy all right like it's just coming out as a boy all right a baby boy is coming towards you guys a spirit baby okay yeah very beautiful energies around that i do see like happiness with that all right i do see happy vibes about a child um yeah your person is coming off as someone that likes to go fishing all right someone that likes to go fishing all right but you're the big catch is what i'm getting they're gonna catch you and they're not gonna want to let you go and they're just gonna try to see if they could catch a bigger fish but i don't see that happening okay <laughs> they're just like wasting time they're learning a lesson here with you all right like i said your person is an introvert okay they like to be alone they like they're kind of like an owl all right they like that alone vibe I see that you're definitely going to be grounded in this relationship, all right? You're going to have your foot really grounded in this relationship. You're going to have to take off your rose-colored glasses when you're with this person, all right? Your antennas are going to have to be up because I do see that because of the passion and the vibes, you may um, not see clearly what is going to be going on, all right? So, um, but what I do see is that this person is going to inspire you a lot in life. That's why they are going to help you become very successful, and also for my little fast and furious um spirit is just saying be careful while you're driving all right no speeding okay you are gonna feel like you are enough for this person this person is gonna make you like they're gonna fill you up this person could also be a gamer or maybe you are playstation xbox that type of jazz all right um there's gonna be a lot of dreaming all right dreaming dreaming about this person them dreaming about you because you guys have a very strong connection i see you guys meeting in the 5d both of you guys are going to have very strong feelings for each other. Like, I love you. I'm in love vibes. All right. A lot of messages. The universe is going to send you a lot of synchronicities, a lot of messages about your connection. They're going to make sure that you're informed. And I do see you guys moving forward with this person towards a very successful energy. All right. Lots of money involved. All right. So I do see you getting a lot of money. I don't know. This person is going to inspire you to like go after your goals or make bigger goals or something like that. I see you getting a lot of money with this person. Um, becoming abundant and within time divine timing this person um will propose this person is going to want to settle down with you all right there's a lot of traveling here so this person can travel for a living all right i do see that you guys are either going to meet um online or in an airport or during travels all right and they're going to help you blossom ascend all right they're going to help you blossom into a new flower which is beautiful and you guys give me mermaid vibes okay bless um you guys are very mysterious your person is gonna find you very mysterious very sexy very attractive very yummy okay and they're gonna be very attracted to your love language your voice you guys definitely have a past life connection all right like i said um you guys have a very strong connection meaning you guys had a relationship in a different lifetime so you're gonna feel very comfortable with this person and you're gonna want to fight for this person because it feels like home and this is where you're gonna want to be um there's just gonna be a lot of you know obstacles to get to where you guys are gonna go is what i'm saying but you are strong and the strong do survive and they do get what they want all right and divine timing it is here that this person um is going to want to propose settle all right you guys are very quiet very loving when it comes to love all right you're not the type to just put it all out there and that's beautiful i do see that um your person when they come in you're going to be in this dry energy when it comes to love you may be in this dry energy wanting love all right so they're definitely going to fill up your cup with lots of it okay bless we have here um hawaii the year 2008 okay bless so this could be significant also and i'm just seeing a lot of money finances so this person may have a lot of money but they're definitely going to help you make a lot of money and they're going to help you with trust how to they're going to help you like with trust, trusting people, trusting situations, trusting your intuition. And you're going to help them realize that trust is a big deal and you earn it. You don't just get it. OK, they're going to learn a lot with you. All right. And we have alien vibes. I want to believe. All right. So you guys definitely give me this energy. And I see that you guys are very spiritual. You guys are tapped in when it comes to the universe. You are manifesting. 
and you guys are star seeds okay and all you do all you need to do is believe and you will manifest you guys have very strong energies uh-huh and as far as signs go we have capricorn taurus and scorpio we definitely got some leo here we definitely have fire aries leo sag there is a lot of fire in your reading a lot of passion just so you know and also yeah a lot of fire jupiter energies all types of fire energies out here okay baby bless now let's go into your pendulum think of a question you may want to ask and we're gonna ask spirit right now while i talk about the raffle all right so spirit what is the answer for part two all right baby as you know, I am Baby Oprah, okay? Yes, I'm Baby Oprah. And I'm out here giving gifts every Monday. So Monday, I'm giving away a Strawberry Shortcake Affirmation deck, which is powerful, beautiful. And I'm also giving away a candle from my shop, which I would choose intuitively just for you, pal, too. Bless. Um, with an extra gift, but that one's a surprise. I'm not telling you what that is. You got to wait till it arrives. All right. So all you have to do to be in it, to win it is subscribe, hit that bell button. And also the, the, um, sponsor for this deck here is Lilac and Lavender Moon. She makes all these awesome decks and all she wants is a follow on Instagram. So subscribe, hit that bell button and follow Lilac and Lavender Moon on Instagram and you are in it to win it, baby. Bless. And she made this strawberry shortcake affirmation deck by the way. She has so many cool decks. Bless. Um and also if you guys want to be friends with me on Instagram, check out my Instagram. Let's be friends. My Instagram is JU1IZZA. Okay, it's down below as well, just in case. And let's be homies. All right, guys, I do post the winner on Monday night or Tuesday morning on my community board here on YouTube and also on Instagram. So that's why it's cool to follow me because I will post you. All right, babe, bless. And I do follow all my winners, FYI. So just so you know, let's just ask a friend. All right, so you definitely speak to a friend, but let's ask again. All right, Spirit, what's the answer? Ask again or change your question. What's the answer, Spirit? All right, guys, so definitely, like I said, consider going to a spiritual shop near you. Get yourself a protection candle or a protection bath. If you don't know one or don't have one, you could definitely check out my shop and get yourself a protection candle or bath. Um, it's definitely going to be very beneficial for you guys as you have some sort of um, energy around you that needs to be purged. And I saw that. All right. So let's avoid that. Let's get healing and blessed up. All right, so that's definitely for you guys. Also, I am going to go into the extended, pal 2. I'm going to play 112 Cupid as I shuffle. I'm going to go deeper into this connection, what's happening, why it's happening. I'm going to see what spirit wants you to know about the connection, key um information about the connection. And I'm also going to get advice from the universe for you guys. So if you want to join me, definitely hit that link down below. It's going to be a party, and we're going to get a lot more info on this, baby. Um, yeah, they really want you to talk to a friend, okay? Because they came out twice, all right, baby? So go speak to a friend about this question, all right? Bless. If I'm going to meet you in the extended, bless, give me a second. I will be right there right now, part two. I love you, okay? Part two, if this is where we're parting ways, I just want to say I love you. You are a divine being having a human experience. You are very intuitive. You have a light, baby. You are here for a reason. You have a mission, all right, and you are on your mission and you're about to embrace this very beautiful connection that's going to take you on a roller coaster. I ain't going to lie, all right, but it's going to be worth the while, okay? And if you don't want to accept this and you don't have to, okay? Bless, free will. You don't have to, but I, I'm just here telling the message, okay? This was coming in. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. If you enjoyed today's reading, please give it a thumbs up as it helps the channel, which I totally love. And it, and it also supports me, which I love and I appreciate from the bottom of my heart, baby. Thank you so much. And for my new sisters and brothers, what's up? How y'all doing, boo? All right, welcome to the family. Yes, this is the family. If you want to think about a family, think about Fast and the Furious, how everybody gathers up with the barbecue vibes in the back and the beers. And hey, family, even if we're not really blood family, we family. Okay. <laughs> and bless good luck to you guys make sure to hit that bell button for notifications and stuff like that all that jazz i post a lot 
all right and also say hi in the comments don't be shy all right hello my beautiful souls baby you already know i love you guys so much i do and i i am just so appreciative of y'all support y'all love and y'all just being here and boosting me and me boosting y'all and we just a family and that's what family's for so i love you guys so much and i'm sending you guys love light and everything nice Mwah. deuces i'll catch you in the next one okay baby bless <laughs> Hey, Paul 3, welcome to your reading. Bless. Thank you so much for meeting me here. All right, guys, let's get it. Let's go. First, we're going to start with your angel number, and then we're going to get into your reading, okay? Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message. Okay. What's that? Number one. Oh, yeah. Please help me channel this message for Paul 3. Spirit, what is Paul 3's angel number? One is all one is new beginnings, okay? So we're in the right place at the right time. Okay, plot three, let's go. Two, three, 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 and we got two numbers. All right. So we got twenty-three, thirty-three, pile one. I mean, whoa. Pile three. Whoa. Um, maybe there's messages for you in pile one. I guess some messages. Um, but let's go, pile three. All right, so 2333 is your angel number go on to google put 2333 angel number meaning and bam there goes your message from spirit also put in 333 because there is a message for you there as well which is very beautiful bless all right guys let me know in the comments what your messages are i love that energy for sure all right paul three we got the mason jar with a sunflower how beautiful is that all right yes so we're talking about happy vibes with the sunflower all right blessings and it's gonna be really full of emotions love bless all right so let's get into this i'm so excited i'm so excited i can't deny it all right pal three <laughs> let's get into your reading we're gonna start with an affirmation and then we're gonna go into your reading okay babe so let's get it let's go let's see what your affirmation is for the day all right this is a reminder from spirit to tell yourself this on a daily basis okay bless all right spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through and help me channel this message for pal three Spirit, what is the affirmation for Pal 3? Affirmation for Pal 3, bless. We have two. All right, we have my outlook on life remains fresh, okay? You always got to have a fresh outlook on life in order to open up some new doors, bless. And my life is rewarding and filled with joy. Look at all them snacks, okay? I'm blessed with that sun looking so happy. All right, so remind yourself, my life is rewarding and filled with joy. My outlook on life remains fresh, always. And I make good, wise decisions because I'm smart, baby. Okay? Bless. All right, let's get into this, baby. So remind yourself that, you guys, your life is full of rewarding um, energies, rewards, and joy. And you guys have this fresh outlook on life, okay? Always remain open-minded when it comes to blessings and rewards and love and blessings and all that good stuff, okay? <laughs> all right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pal 3. Spirit, what is the vibe for Pal 3 with new love? New love. I'm so excited. All right, babe. New love new love new love what's coming in for new love all right we have cindy loper i think that's how you pronounce it all right time after time and it's if you lo if you're lost you can look and you will find me time after time if you fall i will catch you i'll be waiting time after time if you're lost you can look and you will find me time after time if you fall i will catch you I will be waiting time after time, all right? So, um, babe, the first vibe that's coming in with this new love, this new connection is that this person is going to give you time, all right? Time after time is a beautiful vibe. 
this is a very like old school very old school song all right so i feel like when you meet this person pal three you're gonna be in a little bit of a lost energy and you're gonna be manifesting this love this new person and you're gonna feel like this person is coming in right on time for you and they're gonna be very supportive is the vibe that i'm getting also we got 112 peaches and cream okay <laughs> sexy vibes okay peaches and cream I need it because you know that I'm a fiend. Getting freaky in my Bentley limousine. It's even better when it's with ice cream. Know what I mean? Peaches and cream. I need it because you know that I'm a fiend. Getting freaky in my Bentley limousine. Girl, you taste so good to me. It's even better when it's with ice cream. Oh, know what I mean? Peaches and cream. All right. So there's going to be a lot of passion in this connection. All right. And um, some oral sex. Okay. <laughs> Bentley limousine. Okay. So we're talking some money. Okay. So this person could have money. All right. To have a Bentley limousine, you got to have money. All right. So for some of you guys, this new person could be a baller shot caller. All right. Um, bless. <laughs> but they're definitely going to be supportive is what I'm getting. And they're go there's going to be a lot of passion in this connection. All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pal 3. Spirit, what's coming in new love for my singles? What's coming in new love for Pal 3? Bless. You guys have been waiting for this, haven't you? Hmm, I'm getting that vibe. <laughs> All right. I want to know. Okay, I'm going to let you know. <laughs> All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pal 3. Spirit, what's coming in new love for Pal 3? All right, I'm definitely getting that this person is either going to be or have this in their chart, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This person is going to be very sensitive, very emotional, all right? They're going to bottle a lot of their emotions up. But they're going to be full of happiness and joy. You're going to feel successful by this person's side. All right. But just know this person is very sensitive. They bottle up their emotions. And um, there's always more than meets the eye. All right. So things are going to feel deeper than what they express. Okay. So they're going to say one thing and it's going to be deeper than that. Just know that and keep that in mind. All right. Spirit, new love was coming towards pal three. What do they need to know? All right, we have here the King of Wands. Ooh, sexy. All right, we here we do energies. We don't do sex. Okay, so this could be female or male. All right, but I'm definitely in fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Ooh, this person could be an entrepreneur. Someone that's very ambitious. The Fool. This is definitely a new beginning. Mm-hmm. Air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right, this person is sexy. Okay, that's why we got that peaches and cream. You guys are going to want to eat each other up yes baby this person is also a very hard worker this person is very ambitious okay we have the emperor no lie as i said that i knew it all right no matter sex guys this person is a leader i'm getting alpha energy all right this person likes to be in control this person likes to help lead and manage just let them do it all you got to do is just let them do it that's what they're going to want to do Okay, justice, Libra energy. You're going to feel like this is your justice. This is what you've been waiting for. This is what you've been asking for. All right, I feel like you guys feel like um, we have the Ten of Wands here. I feel like you guys may be feeling like, um, you know, like um, right now things are a bit clouded or things are a little bit hazy and you're a little bit question. You're questioning like, um, when am I getting what I deserve? When is this love? When is this relationship coming into play? All right. And this, and what spirit is saying is that the universe is bringing you your person, this connection, and it's going to be massive and you will get what you deserve. Okay. It's just like something about divine timing. And then we have here eight of pentacles. Yeah. You guys are possibly meeting at work or you're going to work together, but there's a lot of energy circling work and being very focused in this connection. So you guys are going to make this work out is what I'm getting, which is beautiful, blessed. And um, there's a lot of thinking. This person is a big thinker. Big, big thinker. Mm -hmm. Very rash type of person too. Like they have a very strong, like I'm getting like an ego. All right. They're, this is an alpha. This person is like, I'm on top. I'm on, <laughs> They're on their altar and nobody's going to tell them anything. All right. This person is very confident. 
very confident. Um, a lot of people are attracted to this person. Spirit, talk to me about Pal 3. New love, what's coming, what's going. All right. We have caring connections, bless. And we have um, third chakra, Archangel Camuel. Kem I can never say it. I don't know why. Camuel. All right. There we go. <laughs> All right. This person is really going to help you with like um, moving forward in life is what I'm seeing. All right, there's gonna be a lot of a lot of ambition here. All right, spirit, talk to me about Pal Three, new love, what's coming, what's going, what's happening. All right, we have keep an open mind. Yes, your soulmate may differ from your usual type, okay, or expectations. We have separation, all right? So you're definitely going to be alone when you meet this person. I feel like there's still some sort of ties to a past person when they come in, okay? We have you deserve love, all right? So the universe is letting you know that you do deserve love. You are entitled to love, all right? That's why I feel like you're like, when is this balance coming in? When, am, when is my justice coming in, my lover? All right, so the universe is saying to you that you do des you do deserve love. And you are definitely lovable. And this person is coming in to play, all right? A lot of flirting energies, all right? A lot of passion. This person is also very attractive. So I definitely see you guys very, having this strong, like, attraction to each other, passion. All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and give me more details on this new person coming into Pal 3's life. All right, spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please give me more details on this new person coming in to Pal 3's life. We have loyal, all right, so this person is very loyal. I'm getting like a family-oriented type of person. We have blue eyes, all right, so either they have blue eyes or you could have a baby with this person that has blue eyes, okay? Okay releasing baggage all right when you meet this person this person is going to be releasing some sort of baggage from their life this could be an ex they're gonna help you release some baggage we got two weeks all right so this person <laughs> could possibly be coming in in two weeks baby yes get ready go go get sexy okay this person right now is um struggling with some sort of finances their endeavors okay sign going on all right this is an ex-lover oh you're in separation with this person. This is someone from your past. Oh, this is not even like a new, new person. Time after time. So yeah, they're coming back. All right, we got party. This person likes to party. All right. Um. Mm -hmm. This blue eye energy is very unique. Okay, so I don't want you guys to get stuck on that. All right, for some of you guys, they have blue eyes. All right, brown hair. All right, so this person could have some brown hair. All right, they keep it natural. All right. A lot of releasing baggage okay brown eyes you see what i'm saying like i knew it spirit was telling me not for everyone blue eyes all right so either they have blue eyes or brown eyes or like a mixture like hazel you know nice eyes big emphasis on the eyes they have nice eyes long-term connection all right so this is someone that's gonna last a while with you all right long-term connection we have green eyes, all right? So, like, it's like, you know, a lot of people be watching the readings, guys. So, we got blue eyes, brown eyes, and green eyes. So, it's either or, okay? Either they got blue, green, or brown eyes. However it goes, they got really beautiful eyes, all right? We got player energy, okay? And why do we have a blank energy? It's blank, all right? Healing, learning together, all right? So, pile three, you are the unique pile, okay? Because you are the one that is having someone come back or this is someone that you're currently dealing with, okay? That you may have ups and downs with and you're not committed, committed, all right? But you guys are healing and learning together. This is a caring connection. And let's get into it, all right? You guys are the unique ones, Pal 3. Let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message for Pal 3. Maybe that's why I got that Pal 1 energy in the beginning because maybe some of you guys are like, uh-uh, I ain't going to go back with this person. Um, I want someone new, all right? Because Pal 1 definitely got someone new. All right, so, but this is what I'm getting here for Pal 3. All right, Pal 3, baby. 
I see that um you in the past dealt with someone who has beautiful eyes. <laughs> all right, um this person is very very attractive. All right, this person comes off to me as an alpha. All right, this person likes to have control, likes to be in control, likes to take care of things. They like vulnerable partners, okay? So I'm not saying that you have to be weak or vulnerable or anything because vulnerability, people think, oh, if you're vulnerable, you're weak. No, it's just that you're open, you're transparent. You're someone that, that it's okay for you to say, I need help. I want you to take the garbage out. I don't got to take it out, all right? Because there's a lot of alpha femmes, you know, alpha masculine men, you know, like no matter your sex, all right? But there's a lot of alphas out here that don't let their partner do what they got to do to feel like like they're in some sort of control in the relationship. So what I'm seeing is that, um, pal three, this person likes to be in control, all right? So when you're dealing with this person, this is an ex-lover. This is someone that's coming in or is here and you guys are, there's a little separation, okay? Or there's some time apart from this person. Maybe you're at a distance from this person, okay? The, it could be different variables to this, all right? So either you're at a distance, you guys are having lack of communication or you're not talking at this very moment. Um, but this is it. This is your person. And you're learning how to love yourself in this connection. All right? Because there's a lot of healing and learning together. This person um, was a player player in the past is what I'm getting. All right? But they're very focused now on their endeavors. They're very focused now on this relationship. I'm seeing this person coming in very passionately, very sexy. All right? Wanting to take a leap of faith with you. And I'm seeing that it is your justice. It is what you deserve. This is something that you know in your soul is meant to happen. And it is, is what I'm seeing here. All right. This has been very overwhelming for you guys, Pal3. This connection is very overwhelming. I'm definitely getting that this is like soulmate, twin flame vibes. All right. Because this is your soulmate is what I'm seeing here. That's why spirit is asking you to keep a very open mind when it comes to this person. They hurt you in the past. They may have lied to you, cheated on you, been a little bit of a player, player. All right. They are very attractive. A lot of people are attracted to them because of either their status, their looks, or the light that they have inside. Because this person has a very strong light. They're like a magnet. A lot of people like, it's like a... It's like moths attracted to a, a flame, okay? A lot of people just get attracted to this person instantly. So I see that it is easy for them to be a player. Um, and they may have acted like this in the past with you. But what I'm seeing is that Spirit wants you to know that um, they want you to extend your lighthearted energy to this person um, and to others. And this person is going to open you up. And that's why they're saying to keep an open mind. Obviously, love yourself first. Because you need to love yourself, respect yourself before you can love someone else. All right, I do see that you guys are going to take a leap of faith with this person. And it's going to feel very heavy. This is not easy. Nothing amazing, nothing great, nothing that's powerful ever comes easy. All right? Steve Jobs, um, Mac Microsoft Word, um, all these people, even Kim Kardashian, even though some people be like, what? <laughs> you know, like a lot of people that are up there, elites, you know. It took a lot of work for them to get there. You don't get powerful blessings, big blessings um, overnight, one. And two, um, it takes work, okay? And that's what I'm seeing here in this relationship. I'm comparing your relationship to the elites because this is a very powerful relationship. And it takes a lot of effort and it takes a lot of work is what I'm seeing. Um, and they're letting me know that here, but... I'm seeing that this person is going to help you in some sort of way when it comes to your endeavors, your goals, success, because I do see a lot of success coming out of this connection. I see you guys being very focused on making this connection work, all right, eye to eye. This is a very caring connection. This person has a lot of feelings for you, and they will always be there for you is what they're saying, all right? Even if you're lost, they will find you, and you guys will always find each other because it is a soulmate connection. You guys are solely tied. If you fall, they will catch you, all right? Now this person wants to be loyal, all right? In the past, this person came off as a player. Right now, this person is releasing a lot of baggage, a lot of karma, and spirit wants you to know that. There is a lot that your person has gone through in life, all right? Their path, their journey that has led them to be this lower vibration player, and not that it's an excuse, but it's part of their learning experience. It's part of their path to learn why they're that way, what they need to do to fix it. And you're part of that. You're part of them fixing themselves. They want to better themselves. They want to fix themselves for you, okay? 
You're the reason why this person wants and desires to heal and be a better person. So you were definitely put in their path so they can grow and they're put in your path so you can grow. All right. I see them helping you some way, somehow with your endeavors and your goals and finances. Within two weeks, something's happening here in this connection. All right. I see this person either communicating with you in two weeks or this connection is going to go off in two weeks. OK, um, something amazing is happening here in two weeks. I do see that your person is struggling with finances, their endeavors, and as an alpha, struggling with their foundation, finances, their job, endeavors, however, goals, contracts, this is like um, terrifying, okay? An alpha needs to be strong and feel strong. And I feel like a lot of the reason why this person may have acted like a player or was being flighty and stuff like that is because they needed to feed their ego, all right? Not an excuse, but I'm just telling you what I see. All right, this person needed to feed their ego because they felt low, especially in this low place where they're struggling with money, finances. They felt very insecure. They feel very insecure. And this player energy is just an ego boost, which is not acceptable, but it's what they do to feel better about themselves because they don't feel that great or they weren't feeling that great about themselves as what I'm seeing. All right, I'm seeing that this person in the past had like a party life they they like to party they like to go out they like to have fun like to be the center of the party or you know like the the light of the party all right the life of the party all right i'm definitely getting that this connection here is a long-term connection you guys are meant to be in a long-term connection you guys are meant to heal with each other you're meant to learn with each other and you're meant to um grow with each other and this is going towards big big energies that's why i compared you guys to the elites this is going places um you need to keep an open mind with this and definitely open up your energy open up your heart make that energy light make it welcoming because i do see you guys going somewhere here you guys have a lot of love for each other there is a very deep connection here that needs to be fulfilled, all right? There's un there's like um unfulfilled potential that needs to happen here. Your story is not over, is what spirit is saying. So, your new love, your next love is someone from your past, pal 3. <laughs> I know, right? And I was hoping that like not for nothing, I'm sorry. I got to say what I got to say and the message is the message. I cannot deny the message, all right? I don't want to get in trouble with spirit. But I was saying, because I've done, like, new love readings in the past, and there's always one pile that has, like, an ex or a, or a person from the past coming back or someone that they're dealing with that, you know, they're going to continue dealing with that person and stuff like that. And people get so upset. People get so bothered. Like, I don't want that person. I don't want to deal with that. All right? But listen, there is some unfair unfulfilled potential here that needs to be fulfilled all right there is a destiny with this person that you are going to fulfill with you know so it's totally on you free will all right i'm just the messenger <laughs> i am just the messenger yeah you guys are going to be healing together and building together a lot of building uh-huh yeah i definitely got that uh-huh water energy lots of water energy it's beautiful vibes and it's taking a long time for you guys to get this marriage or this marriage energy from your person look six of cups they're coming back this is your soulmate all right they're not coming back they're coming towards you um this is meant for you four of wands this is marriage this is celebration this is holidays this is that beautiful energy that everybody wants happy home happy vibes and that's what you guys are meant to fulfill here in this destiny with your person and that's what they're coming to do with you bless <laughs> okay all right guys we're going into charmies now um this is my pendulum think of a question you may want to ask i'm gonna swing it after the charmies guys i'm definitely doing an extended and this one's gonna be juicy because you guys have a lot of history so there's juice here to expose and i'm gonna do an extended i'm gonna play time after time by cindy um while i shuffle and then i'm gonna see what spirit wants you to know about this connection where it's going how it's happening etc etc what's unfolding with this person all right and i'm gonna get messages i didn't get messages for the other piles because their people were new yours is past so i'm gonna get messages from your person what they want to say to you and some advice from the universe all right guys so if you want to join me definitely join me um the link is down below you are more than welcome to bless baby all right so let's go um if you're sensitive to noise this is when you want to lower the volume guys 
hold on let me just um send a very important message uh-huh Okay, let's go. All right, spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, please help me channel the charmies for pod three. Sensitive guys, lower the volume. All right, ready, set, go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, we got new Charmies. Okay. Hello. Hello. I went shopping yesterday and I was like, Charmies! I lost my mind in the store. I was like, yes! <gasps> Alright, let's go. Spirit Internet this is University of the Guys Angels. Get some initials for Pal 3. Alright, let's go. We're gonna do story time before we do Charmies, FYI. All right, so definitely brace yourself. <laughs> I don't know why. I guess it's a powerful message in here. Um, this is my bath bag, guys. I put my bath salts and my rose petals in here and the herbs on the side. This is, this is a three-day bath. So if you guys are interested in any baths, protection, healing, love, abundance, check out my shop. Check out my shop down below, all right? Spirit, what can you tell me about Pau Three's lover and this connection? okay all right we got here i definitely see you guys healing all right a lot of healing happening here which is beautiful all right so that means you guys are ascending you guys are hiring your vibe i see travels here so your person may be traveling towards you or traveling in general or you're traveling but i'm seeing some traveling that's gonna help you guys ascend all right um i do see you guys communicating with this person i see you really really happy about it all right children could be a factor in this connection for some of you guys I do see fun being illuminated, all right? So you guys are definitely going to be having fun with this person. You are manifesting them. You are you are just bringing them in like a magnet, okay? I see that this person is following you. So this could be on social media or they're trying to keep tabs with friends, family, however it goes. I see that they feel like you're very unique. You're very different. You're from out of this world like an alien. <laughs> and um, you guys are ascending. You guys are definitely climbing the ladder. You're going to be opening up new doors. And they're watching you as you open up these new doors. They're very impressed. I see that you are putting a stop to something in your past. Like a karmic energy. You're not letting a karmic near you or around your energy anymore. And this karmic is very surprised. All right. So if you were... I don't know. I'm getting like a competition. If there was a karmic that was competing with you or something like that, maybe tied to you or your person, I'm just saying that you're putting this, you're putting a stop to this and the karmic is going to be very surprised that your energy changed or something. All right. Or this could be a family member, a friend, whatever karmics in your life, you're putting a stop to that, like competing energy or combating energy. And they're going to be surprised. Uh, vacation is in order in divine timing okay so you and your person will be going on vacation beach vibes in divine timing i see that you're tired you want a vacation okay so that is definitely coming in in the right time spirit is saying i do see that um you are going to be illuminated all right a lot of people are going to be focusing on you um i see your phone going off all right so a lot of messages this could be because of business or friends all right i'm seeing the forbidden fruit here all right so i definitely see that um you're going to find out about some sort of forbidden fruit, a child or something like that. Um, maybe during the date, your person is going to talk to you about some sort of forbidden fruit. Maybe they bit the forbidden fruit in the past or there's something that you guys need closure on that you're going to be talking about during dinner. All right, baby. Bless. All right, let's go into Charmies. Charmy time. All right. And this was story time with Jalissa. Bless. <laughs> all right let's go into the charms though we have so much going on here whoa wowzers all right let's go wow all right i need to i need to clean this up because i cannot channel like this all right so give me a second hello there how you guys doing welcome welcome to the family all right guys welcome to the family i hope you guys are enjoying yourselves here if you are new um if so definitely consider being part of the family 
here with my family we are um we are family <laughs> all my brothers sisters and me all right i don't know that just came through but we are definitely that type of family okay and spirit is just out here giving y'all blessings okay bless um no i'm just reading i'm reading with while i'm talking i'm trying to multitask sorry guys um but yeah if you like it here definitely consider staying all right i am baby oprah bless um i'm always out here blessing people so if you want to be part of my weekly raffle every monday i'm giving something away all right all you have to be all you have to do to be in it to win it is subscribe and hit that bell button all right guys um and i'll talk more about that after the charmies okay bless hi my ogs how you guys doing baby okay bless all right guys um I was distracted. I was trying to give my normal um message and I got distracted because the messages that were coming in. All right, so Paul 3, um, definitely you guys got this Phoenix vibe going on with the judgment energy. So the universe is coming in and they're rebirthing this connection. All right, so this connection is gonna come up out of the ashes. All right, and we got the six of cups here, which is definitely that energy I pulled from your reading. This is a soulmate connection. All right, your soulmate may differ from your usual type is kind of like what's coming in. But this is your soulmate and they're coming back and you guys are going to restore this connection. Be very careful if you're not looking for a child because I do see baby vibes. OK, there's a lot of passion here, possibly sex. All right, I'm seeing that you guys are restoring this like it's nobody's business. Um, You guys are definitely bringing in this balance. It's going to feel like a wish fulfillment. And you guys are going to be working very hard to make this work, is what I'm seeing. Very focused on making this work. And I also see you guys doing very well with the endeavors when this person comes in. All right, guys. So, so let's go into initials. First, middle, last initial. This could be yours or your person. We have M, P, J, S, E, D, M, F, Z, T, M, O, J W R G H J A Y I M C S L. All right, so this could be yours or theirs. First, middle, last, initial. Now let's get into the charmies because this is very interesting. All right, so definitely you guys are about to bag things up. All right, everything is about to be bagged up. A lot's going on, all right? Laundry is going to be done, basically. You're bagging up all the dirty clothes. You're about to do laundry, and you're going to have a set of new clothes to wear, all right? Refreshing vibes. Now, there is a lot going on here in this connection, pal three. So many people involved, okay? Look at all these destiny whales. Like, hello? There's two karmics in the way of this connection, all right? So this could be exes, friends, family, lovers, all right? I do see the karmic in the i saw it in story time where there's a karmic that's gonna be surprised that you're not combating with them or you're not worried about them um but i'm seeing two karmics trying to intervene in this connection all right but this is not gonna work is what i'm getting because the wheel is turning all right the wheel is turning in y'all favor we have the wheel of fortune here so everything is happening in your favor is what spirit wants you to know all right, some of you guys, your person may play sports, ball, okay? I'm definitely seeing here, wow, all right, listen, big message. If you're not looking to get pregnant or get someone pregnant, definitely use protection because there is baby vibes on the table, all right? I'm seeing a boy and a girl, all right? So you could either get pregnant, have a boy, or get pregnant, have a girl, or get pregnant, have twins, and have a boy and a girl, Okay? <laughs> But babies are on the table. So definitely be very careful if you're not trying to have a child. Your person is coming back as a loyal person, all right? This person is coming towards you with loyalty, okay? Look at this fish in the tank, okay? Yes, the fish is in the tank. All right, I'm definitely getting Pisces energy with this fish, all right? Um, But this is an energy of someone that is very emotional and bottles up their emotions, introvert vibes, all right? They process their emotions alone, all right? So this person is used to processing their emotions, their trauma, everything they go through alone. And Spirit wants you to know that, all right? Maybe you could help them with this, okay? I see a lot of money, all right? So a lot of money is destined to come in, bless. And um, what this person finds very attractive about you is the fact that you're so ambitious, you're so motivated, you're a go-getter, all right? I love you to the moon and back. So there is a lot of love here and things are deeper than they seem, all right? 
this is deeper than you even know is what spirit is saying this is a wish fulfillment and there is a lot of mystery here a lot of confusing energies you are in a cycle with this person um dreams will come true you need to trust the process and have faith okay you guys are on a path and you're going towards a lot of success a lot of blessings all right maybe that's where that money comes in okay <laughs> you're definitely on a mission okay i see that the universe has your back all right you guys are manifesting manifestations are in order and they're coming in you just don't probably see it right now but i'm telling you okay your ancestors are watching over you and they are blessing you as well so not only does the universe have your back but your ancestors are here having your back too you have a lot of support pal three a lot of support Mm-hmm. we're all mad here alice in wonderland all right so as you take leaps of faith in your life people will judge you like yo you're crazy like how are you gonna do that like whoa but guess what that's why all the miracles are coming into your life because you do take leaps of faith the more leaps of faith that you take the more that you trust blindly in the universe and the process the more the miracles come in for you all right you got to be brave to take a leap of faith into the unknown so bless remember that you are their sunshine all right they're letting you know you are my sunshine you are what makes me happy you are what fills up my cup with joy and happiness there's a lot of recognition coming in always remember spirit is saying always remember you are braver than you believe stronger than you seem smarter than you think and loved more than you know okay remember that don't underestimate your energy or your power as far as signs go we have gemini here mm -hmm. we have fire aries leo sagittarius a lot of it all right and then we have some water cancer pisces scorpio all right baby but unless this could be your sign their sign within y'all charts all right that's what's going on all right guys so now we're gonna do the pendulum and we're gonna talk about the raffle as it swings okay so think of your question baby spirit what's the answer all right guys as you know i am baby oprah <laughs> and i'm proud so monday i am giving away this strawberry shortcake affirmation deck along with a candle from my shop and an extra gift it's a surprise i'm not telling you what it is that's what makes it so special all right all you have to do to be in it to win it is subscribe to my channel hit that bell button also the sponsor for this deck is lilac and lavender moon on instagram she just wants a follow that's all she wants and she's out here giving free decks to the family and it's gonna be unlimited i have more decks coming she makes such great decks that's why i collaborated with her and i wanted you guys to have some decks and get some gifts all right so all you have to do is subscribe hit that bell button follow lilac and lavender moon on instagram and you are in it to win it bless my instagram in case you want to connect with me is j u one i z z a bless i post a winner on youtube on my community board monday night tuesday morning and i post it on instagram so that's why it's cool to follow me because then you'll know um you'll get both alerts okay baby bless good luck to you guys if you already did it you're already in it to win it okay your answer part three is yes all right yes and bless all right baby i love you now i'm gonna go up to the extended where i'm gonna go deeper into this and see what else spirit wants you to know look the, the fishies want to know too what else spirit wants you to know about your connection and what's coming from this and where it's going and etc cetera, etc cetera, because this is powerful i'm gonna get messages from your person as well and i'm also gonna get advice from the universe your ancient ancestors because they got your back so i know they got a few things to say to you the link to that is down below bless i hope to meet you there if so give me a second baby i will be right there all right pal three I love you so much. You guys are my soul sister, my soul brothers. You guys are on a mission and you're super powerful. Tap in, baby. Tap in. That's all I got to say. All right, babe. Listen to your own intuition and take your own guidance at all times because you are very powerful. You have that light. Yes, you do. All right. So I hope you enjoyed today's reading. If so, definitely give it a thumbs up as it helps the channel and i appreciate that so much guys you don't even know i really do look forward to the likes because it makes me feel like i'm doing a good job with you guys um here on the channel and you guys want to see more stuff more content like the one i post you know it helps with that and um also if also um for my new sisters and brothers what's up <laughs> what's up 
<laughs> all right welcome to the family you are definitely not um gonna regret becoming part of this family everybody is so sweet and nice and chill and vibing okay so welcome to the family make sure to hit the bell button when you subscribe and also say hello all right say hello um, i don't bite I don't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. Um, my OGs, baby. I love you guys so, so much. I really do from the bottom of my heart. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah. Deuces. Bless. I love you. <laughs>